Paul D'Agostino. I'm a defenseman um, from just outside Boston, Massachusetts. This is uh, my second year in Louisiana. Uh, <laughs> neither year has actually gone the way we wanted it to, which is uh, a little bit unfortunate, you know, but I think we got the right attitude now. We got a good group of guys, good mix, good fan base, good town. We got all the right ingredients for a winner, so hopefully we can start putting things together here, get things back to where they're supposed to be. I started playing hockey when I was five years old, absolutely hated it. Uh, quit. Started up again when I was nine, and I'm embarrassed to say it's because of the movie Mighty Ducks. Uh, I know that's pretty bad, but it's true. I went to high school in Boston, uh, Catholic Memorial. It was like a big time like high school back there and everything. And had a great four years there. Went on to college at uh, UMass Lowell for two years, and then I uh, decided to try my hand at uh, pro hockey after that. It was a little early for me. I played one year pro, I was all over the map. I started off in uh, Providence, Rhode Island, went on to Lubbock, Texas, Tulsa, Oklahoma, Pensacola, Florida, and Trenton, New Jersey, and that was all just one season. Last year, I came back to pro hockey, um, played in Louisiana to finish out the season, came back here this year. I love the town, it's actually really similar to the college town I went to in Canada, just with all the, uh, you know, all the fun, plenty of trouble to get into. I wish the team, I wish the team had won more games this year, obviously. That's the number one goal, and uh, you know we haven't been doing it, but we do have a different attitude now. We got a new coach in here, and new group of guys, and uh, I think it's funny, we've had like what, like six guys left from the start of the year, which is you know, kind of crazy. That doesn't happen on most teams, but I think we got a good mix now. Um, you know, I just wish that, me personally even, I wish that I would play tougher. I know that the fans want to see our team play tougher. They want to see the fights. They like that stuff. I, I don't know. We go out. We pretty much go to uh, you know downtown area. Try keep a low profile, I guess. Uh, just try to have fun in this town. You know, there's plenty of spots to do it as long as you pick your right spots and you know mature about it and all that. Have you gone so, hunting or fishing or anything like that? I I mean I'm from Boston. We don't do much hunting or fishing or anything like that. Uh, pretty much in Boston, you either play hockey or drink, and uh, some people do a little bit of both. About getting the fans fired up for the games, uh, it kind of comes back to what I was saying about like team toughness and all that. You know, we got a few guys who are definitely willing to uh, fight every single game. I know my roommate; he's kind of a psycho, and he like he lives for it. You know. But uh, I know that, like I said, myself personally and a few other guys definitely capable of doing it. And uh, I think if we do that, it's going to start to fill this place a little bit more.